Good morning. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe I'm making a video right now. I'm so excited, but I'm nervous at the same time. I'm a, I'm a weirdo, okay? I'm a weirdo. Good morning, it is Sunday. It is 10.14 right now. I really don't have much planned today. My Sundays are pretty relaxed. Usually today, I'll usually like run some errands, get some groceries or just some stuff I need for the week, plan out content for the week and things like that. But yes, welcome to a little day in my life. Um, like I said, I've been trying to record for YouTube for so long. I know even people have been, were asking me in my DMs like, when are you gonna record them on me? I'm just like, I don't know. Here I am recording. Like I said, I don't really have much planned today. I'm just really blessed that I woke up this morning without a hangover. I went out last night, I had a little bit too much to drink and um, I woke up and I was feeling good this morning, okay? And this has also been keeping me alive as well. Mm -hmm. The goat, okay? This drink is so good. <laughs> Before I start my day, I have to wash this crusty face, okay? I still have on last night's mascara and makeup. Um, I think I just literally just walked in the house last night and just wiped a towel over my face and I just went to bed. I was exhausted. I'm probably gonna have a pimple in a couple days, but it's okay, because that's what I get for not doing my last night skincare routine. So we're making it up for it this morning. I don't know about anybody else, but doing my skincare in the morning is like, the only thing that puts me, it just it just gets my morning together. It's like a morning ritual I do while I say like my affirmations. It just gets me in the mood for the day. I just feel like you you need some, when you wake up, you need something that gets you in the mood and skincare just does it for me. And also taking my morning shit. So I'm gonna go do that too. It is now 12.17 and I just had to put a load in the washer because I, when I got out the shower and got done doing my skincare, my like morning ritual, I realized I didn't have any more panties. So I had to wash. Um, do you guys see my beautiful flowers? They are still intact and they still look beautiful. They smell delicious too. So that's gonna stay here for a while. But yeah, anyway, I need to make me something to eat before I pass out. I have not ate all morning. All I had was a banana and that coconut water. I don't know why I do this to myself. Now I'm like irritable, shaky, I just need something to eat. I'm trying my hardest to stop spending money and um, cook whatever is in the house. So let's see if we can find something to eat in the house because I'm saving money all this year. I'm gonna try, so. I found something to eat. Is it 12 o'clock and I'm eating breakfast? Yes. It is, okay? Don't talk about me. I'm the type of person that I have breakfast at like 10 o'clock, all right? It's normal. Normalize having breakfast at any time of the day because breakfast is good. And it's the only simple thing I know how to cook because I really don't know how to cook. So when I make my gourmet eggs in Spam, I like to have bread with my stuff, but there is no more bread. Maybe I should have, you know, checked and see how much bread we had before I made this because I don't like to eat the booty part. I have a very unhealthy relationship with my Stanley cup. I can't use any other cup because I just love this cup so much. First, I was anti Stanley cup, like absolutely not. I'm not paying $40 for a cup absolutely not but then i went on a little like i went on a staycation with a friend with a brand i was like her plus one and they gave out free stanley cups as like the gift for you to go home and i tried it out and i am in love with it i mean it literally keeps your drink cold all day like all day they could knock the price down from 40 dollars, but it is a nice cup bon appetit don't mind my washer it has a mind of its own i don't know why it's so loud but Whatever. Now I am walking to the car. I didn't park over here. God damn it, I parked the other way. We are walking to my car because we're gonna go to Ulta. I think I need to go to Target to grab something. And yeah, those are the two errands we have to run. So let's go. Later. Oh, my dumb ass literally just spilled water all over my driver's seat in my car because my oh, cup. No, no was not closed the whole way. What am I gonna do now? We have to take my boyfriend's car now because I'm not driving in this. I'm not having a wet ass in the store, absolutely not.
All right, we've made it in Ulta. What I came in here to get is some ingrown hair serum cream. When I got out the shower this morning, I was looking for my ingrown serum cream to put under my arms and you know, like down there on my kuda mama, and I couldn't find it. It's like my kuda mama serum cream just got legs and walked away, you know what I'm saying? I don't know where I put it. I could not find it. I was looking for it everywhere. So I'm just gonna go ahead and buy the one I really like. This is actually my favorite and one I highly, highly recommend. This one is really good. Um, it's kind of pricey though. It's $52. The big one is $52, but if you get the little one, the little one is way cheaper, 36. That's still kind of pricey. This stuff is really good. I highly recommend fur for using like any type of scrub or any type of ingrown. If you have ingrown hair issues or discoloration, this is what you need, baby. Then I wanna go ahead and grab me an eyebrow pencil from the Fenty section. I like the medium brown eyebrow pencil from Fenty. Oh my gosh, this, I, I, I'm type person, my eyebrow pencil has to be really soft. I don't like the really hard pencils and things like that. I really love the Fenty eyebrow pencil, like this is my favorite, so I'm gonna get this. I was like kinda going around the store seeing if I needed anything else, but you know what? I'm gonna stop the overconsumption that I have a bad habit of, and I'm just gonna get what I need. I came in here for two things, and I'm gonna leave with two things, okay? Not gonna buy any more, because I don't need it. Saving money, remember, we're saving money. Lots of stuff secured. Next is Target. We made it to Target. Target just got these new perfumes that I've been wanting to try and smell. I've been seeing these all over TikTok and people say it smells really good. Hold on, we're gonna spray it. Oh, that smells good. That's Manificent Candy, but it's all gone. God damn TikTok always does that shit. Let's smell another cherry. I don't like that one. Okay, one more. Let's smell flower bed. Oh, this doesn't have a thing on it. I'm gonna put it on my wrist. Oh, that one smells good. Flower bed smells really good. I wanna smell one more. Okay, let's smell sweet on the outside. That one stinks. Okay, let's smell one more. <laughs> We're just gonna smell them out. Okay, this is Sun Fahora. I'm gonna smell this one. That one stinks too. What the? Okay, one more. Let's. <coughs> Got it. Okay, let's smell before the rainbow. Okay, I can't really smell it. Hold on, I'm gonna put it on my wrist. No. The only one that kind of smelled like something to me was Manificent Candy. And that one's not even up there anymore, so I can't even get it, so. If you're looking for a really good Marcella water, like a cleanser, like how to take your makeup off, I absolutely love this one. I have this one at home. I got mine off Amazon though. I wish I would've knew that Target sell these because I would've just got it from here, but I love Bioderm Bioderma. And then they also have, I think this is a body wash and a cleanser. This is so big though, like, this is too big. It's way too big. I'm gonna go ahead and grab me some bananas go. because I like to make smoothies in the morning. Oh my gosh, I can't even grab it. Be fucking for real. Bruh. It's unnecessary hard. Also gonna go ahead and just get some baby spinach. I like to put baby spinach in my smoothies. I don't like drinking my smoothies every morning without spinach, you know what I'm saying? So. To grab me some baby spinach too. I should also give me some new lashes as well. My favorite are the Naked Lashes by Ardell. These are super cute, I have these ones. And then I should get another pair. What other pair should I get though? I'm gonna get these two. I just noticed I caught those lashes Arnell. It's Ardell. <laughs> My bad. Ooh, Target was busy today. I have to go to one more store. I have to go to Best Buy because I need to get a battery for this camera because this camera keeps trying to die on me. So let's go to Best Buy. We're in Best Buy. Like I said, I need to find a battery. So we have to look for where the batteries are for this specific camera. I have the Sony uh, ZF V1. I don't, I don't know. I found where the camera is. I just don't see where the batteries are. Wow, y'all cleared out these cameras. There is no cameras. We're gonna have to ask for help. 
I'm looking for a battery for this camera. It's the Sony. Okay. I don't know if he wanted his face recorded. <laughs> I got a battery, but this shit is like $50 for this little battery. We're gonna see on Amazon if they got anything cheaper because I want to like a couple batteries. I just don't want, you know, just two. Maybe I get one more, but maybe I'm gonna go to Amazon and see if something's cheaper because this is $50. The worst vlogger in the world award goes to me, okay? I had let my camera charge and I completely forgot about it. It is fucking 9.25. I've been home for about a good four or five hours just sitting here watching TV. I'm sorry, I'm gonna get better as I keep going. Give me a break, this is my first vlog. I ordered Taco Bell. I'm, I'm trying, trying my hardest to stop, stop spending money and um, cook whatever is in the house. I know, I know, I said we were saving. It didn't happen. So I'm full, like I said, I'm sitting here watching this show called Physical 100. It is just like Squid Games. Instead, the people who lose don't die, they just go home. Okay, that was my Sunday. Um, I didn't get any work done. Well, I got this done, so that was work, but I was just saying in towards of TikTok, like I didn't think of any content to post for tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. How are you? Um, so this week didn't start off on the right foot at on the right foot in terms of TikTok. You know what I'm saying? But yes, this is my first Sunday vlog. My first vlog. Definitely let me know in the comments how you guys are feeling today's vlog. Um, definitely be honest. I take criticism very well. I'm just joking. I am a baby. Go easy on me, okay? <laughs> but thank you guys so much for all the support with my shorts. Like I said earlier this morning. It has took me forever to come around and stop being a, beating around the bush and actually do a video because I have been procrastinating it because I've been having so much anxiety about it. But I'm so glad that I just stepped out on faith and I was just like, you know what? I'm going to record today and we're just going to... Everything is always working out for me. That is an affirmation I will forever say. So... <laughs> Like I said again, I hope you guys liked today's vlog. Leave me a comment and don't forget to like, comment, and share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next week.